Leo, hi, welcome to my channel, Beyond the Moon. I am doing a peek at your person. Love tarot reading. All right. So, Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus, if this does not resonate, please check your other placements for messages there. Feel free to cross watch, but don't force anything to fit. Okay, some messages may be for you, some may not. Take what resonates, leave the rest. All right. Leo, stick around till the end. I'm going to pull some letters, numbers, zodiac signs to see who it is you're dealing with. And also, please subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment below, and if you'd like to book a personal reading, information's in the description box below. Leo, wow, your overall energy, crazy. Uh, there's been some chaos and conflict here in your life, and I feel like you're walking away from that. You're leaving it behind. You are manifesting something that is going to make you very happy, something where you feel more passionate about a loving caring nurturing nature something that fulfills you i think whatever it is that you're walking away from has been arguments disputes chaos just craziness and you're done you're walking away from it um i do see angel numbers here 33 and 22. all right let's see what's going on with your person leo leo's person's overall energy orphaned yep now they're feeling abandoned because you walked away you walked away now they're feeling left out in the cold abandoned orphaned alone what else is going on what else is going on with leo's person well, they have new life. I feel like this is saying they, they want you back. I mean, who wouldn't, Leo? Who wouldn't want you back? I think they want a new life with you here. They're trying to follow their intuition. Oh, we yeah, have yang. Yin yang. They're trying to follow their intuition, possibly on like how to approach you, what's meant for them. They have 33 as well over here. I feel like you were just feeling you guys weren't yin yang. All right. You usually pop up as the yang Leo, that fiery, fierce, go getter energy, but you're showing up here with some love and compassion. So it makes me wonder. Makes me wonder. Let's see. Let's get into it. Current situation for Leo's person. Leo, keep in mind the energies can be flip-flopped and reversed because it is a general reading. So when I say your person, it could be your energy, okay? So place it where you see fit. Current situation for Leo's person. What's going on? Current situation for Leo's person. Queen of Cups. Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Was somebody emotionally blocked off? Was this more of a sexual, passionate connection here? There could have been like emotional instability, outbursts, um, jealousy, things like that. Um, King of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Somebody was cold and cut off here. Page of Pentacles. Oh, let's see. Was somebody not offering you what you deserved? Queen of Wands now. Aries, Leo, Sag energy. Was this a third party situation? Was somebody pretending to be single and they weren't actually single? I have three people showing up here right away. I have water, fire, and air. Then I have the Nine of Pentacles, that single solo energy. And the wheel in reverse, something stopped. Something came to a screeching halt here. Uh, Leo, I feel like it was time for you to walk away. There could have been a third party situation. Somebody was acting single and they weren't actually single. Or they were single and they were going around, doing whatever they wanted, non-committal. I think you got tired of their behavior, Leo. Let's see, what were the blockages here for Leo and this person? Blockages, blockages. Things, I feel like this person couldn't give you what, what you wanted, what you deserved. Ace of Swords, they weren't honest. They weren't truthful, they weren't honest. I feel like it didn't start off on a stable beginning here. I feel like it was just chaos, conflict, confusion. 
the world. There could be distance between the two of you, travel, living at a distance, something like that. Um, Nine of Pentacles again. Eight of Swords. Somebody was stuck or felt stuck or you, Leo, could have felt like your hands were tied with this person. There was nothing you could do to change this person's perspective or change the situation here. What else? Blockages. Someone could have been stuck in another connection. It was a burden. Blockages, sorry. Blockages, blockages. Blockages for Leo and their person. Blockages. The chariot. Cancerian energy. Did you guys live at a distance? So seeing each other was hard and this person kind of just played the field, acted single. Maybe you always had to go to them, not them come to you. It just became too much. Yeah, they weren't putting their attention on you, Leo. And I, I feel like victory and success is being blocked here because somebody was juggling. There's definitely multiple people involved. Giving to two, breadcrumbing, things like that. Somebody was juggling. Oh boy, oh boy. What is this person's intentions? Death, rebirth, scorpionic energy. Now they want to transform this. What are their intentions? Nine of cups in reverse. What are their intentions? What are their intentions for Leo? What is this person's intentions? I feel like you really cared about this person, Leo. I feel like you really did care about them. I feel like, all right, this person's trying to make a decision here to transform this connection and not be a player and not have it be a sexual, just sex only, sex based, passion based. I feel like they want to build with you or gain some kind of stability here. Or at least be on the same page and have the same goals. There's too many people involved. Competition. Uh, they're going to, I think they're going to come towards you, Leo, with an apology. They know, they know that they put you in, in drama, chaos, competition, too many people involved, heated arguments. Um, oh, sorry. Let's see. How does this person truly feel about you, Leo? How does this person feel about you? The Emperor. They see you as boss energy. They know, th and they have regrets. They know that they can't get away with anything. You're, you're Leo, for crying out loud. They want to talk. They're stressed out. They don't want to feel stuck. They don't want anyone to feel like their hands are tied. It's like they know they stressed you out. They know the damage they did. They have regrets here. I mean, you're Leo, your boss energy. You're the life of the party. You're a go-getter. You take action. You go after what you want. You're driven. You're powerful. You are a powerful force not to be reckoned with, and they, they did. They want, they want a new beginning. They, they love you. They have emotion for you. They know they either kept you stuck or they themselves were stuck in a cycle that they, they didn't know how to get themselves out of. They put themselves in it. They want to talk now. They have regrets. They want to talk about it. So let's see, Leo, what are you going to do? Potential outcome here for Leo. Keep in mind, you have free will. So do they. You can change your mind. So can they. This is just a potential outcome. Let's see what's going to happen. What's going to happen with Leo and this person? Page of Cups, the lovers, King of Pentacles. I think you have somebody new. 
possibly an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, the lovers, Gemini, energy. Right, hold them back. What is this? Tell me more potential outcome for Leo. They want to reconcile judgment, um, scorpionic energy. Yep. They want, okay. Oh, now they want commitment. Now they're ready to take this. Wow, look at this. Now they're ready to take this leap of faith, Leo, and commit or level this connection up. Now they see you're their soulmate. However, I'm going to flip this real quick. I'm going to flip this real quick. So take this how it resonates. You're holding back from this person. They want to reconcile. You're trying to make a, a head over heart logical decision here. You're making this choice in love. I think you're going after somebody else, but let me just tell you who this somebody else is. I think you're about to take a leap of faith for a new, <laughs> a new beginning here in love, passion, attraction, chemistry, history, someone from the past, not this person. I think you're going back to somebody else. You might be reconciling and reigniting a flame with an old flame. You know what I'm saying? I think there, there's somebody else here that you are choosing instead of this person. And that's what you're trying to manifest, I feel like. You're trying to manifest this other person. It could be a karmic cycle. The, you, you may have left that person to go towards this person. This person, chaos, conflict, third party, can't commit, blah, blah, blah. And now you're realizing the other person. You may have had that wake-up call. And I feel like you want to go back to that other person, not this person. Does that make sense? I hope I'm not confusing you. So now you may have a choice between this person and a, a past past person. You may have a choice here. And I think I know which one you're going to choose. I don't think it's this person whose energy came out. I think it's the other person. But take it how it resonates. You do have a, a new beginning here. All right. Um, obstacles. Courage. So you may have to get into your Leo, fierce Leo energy. I feel like you're operating right now more on love, compassion, and understanding. You may need to get back into your uh, fiery, fierce, courageous, lioness energy. All right. And find that, that side of you again if, if you buried it. Uh, the possibilities. So seeing the possibilities here, finding harmony, peace, and understanding. I literally was going to say that. It was upside down. You're trying to do the right thing. You're trying to do things morally here. Um, but you know what you have to do, I feel like. But make your own decisions. I'm not here to tell you what to do. I feel like you're going back to somebody else. All right, let's see. What do we got for Leo? Blessings, protection, attention, love. Your guides are always with you. Some for some, this could be a blessing in disguise. I feel like it was a lesson learned, you know. Um, community, friendship, fun, a light heart, enjoy downtime with friends and family. Fall changes in the air. Yep, something's about to change for you, Leo. In a big, in a big way, transformation. See, I told you. Breakthrough, reinvention, you're ready for the next level, stuck, block, third party, silence, barrier, shift your focus, clear the energy and rise above, drama, obstacles, pettiness, find the strength to rise. That's what this person, this connection was putting you through, drama, feeling stuck, feeling like you have to chase them or, I don't know, cat and dog race going on or something like that. You're rising above it though, you're walking away from that. All right, let's see, let's see, messages for Leo from this person. I'm afraid to contact you. I want to tell you how I feel. Finding out the truth crushed me. We will be together again. I know that I crossed the line with you. 
I hope I will see you again sometime. I don't know how to let you go. Uh, I never used to look at you that way. I am different now. I've been struggling. Could be you, could be them, could be the other person here. All right, place it where you see fit. Let's get some letters. Could spell a name, uh, a word of significance, first, middle, last name. Um, if they have the first, same, sorry, same first and last initial, feel free to duplicate it. I only have one of each. All right. All right, we got S, X, H, K, L, G, Q, Y, E, A, D, and I'm seeing C, V, U, and I. So C, V, U, I, S, X, H, K, L, Y, G, Q, D, E, A. All right, numbers could be birthday, anniversary, number of days, weeks, months, years, could be a date of significance, an angel number, an age, place it where you see fit, Leo. All right, we have 5, 7, 10, 12. So it could be the 5th, the 7th, the 10th, or 12th of any month. Uh, it could be May, July, October, December. I'm also seeing 57, 75. All right, zodiac signs could be their star sign, sun sign, strong placements in their charts, or it could something could happen during that season, like Leo season, for instance. All right, we have... Taurus, Taurus, Leo, Capricorn. So double Taurus, Leo, Capricorn, and Aries. All right, could be any of those signs, could be strong placements, could be anybody. Um, I did have Scorpio, Gemini, Cancer came out, Aquarius, Pisces, I think came out, Aries, um, Taurus, yeah. Could be anyone, you guys. All right, place it where you see fit. But Leo, that is what I have for you this week. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video, comment below. And if you'd like to book a personal reading, information's in the description box below. And until next time, Leo, love and light. Take care.